Hmm. Could be good for, uh... For Peck. Or Flap, rather. Hello. Would you battle me across the fence if you saw me there? Or across the wall, I guess. Over the wall. Over the garden hedge. Over the hedge. <coughs> Over the shoulder. Reverse. Shot, reverse shot. You want to stop that? I mean, it's okay if you don't. I'm not gonna listen. To your pleas of agony. Please stop it, because I am in agony, in other words. You can't get me. You can try, but you can't. Did I see? I did. Run away! Diglet dig, diglet dig, trio, trio, trio. Oh no, it's Meowth! Run! I like that you can just pick out herbs, and they're the, uh... <clears throat> you can pick out herbs, and they are... the medicinal items. You know, Sonny, you've grown up since your adventures with Violet and Klaus. Milk Ring, can I catch one of those here? Pretty sure it's a fairy type. Is it using a negative priority move? Because if it partially lowered my speed and it was going second. Oh no, it lowered my evasion, duh. Alright, I am going to look up where Milkery is. Current recommendations. Habitat. Uh, it's in this area. And also in the wild area down here. Oh, wait a minute. It says on the left side that they're all around this area. So would I have to go into the grass to find them or something? Three, one. Guess I'll browse around here for a little bit. There he is. There's Milkery. Oh no. Wait, does it have Prankster? Is that why it's going first? 
No? Maybe not? Maybe it's a speed tie? I don't know. Either way, having a fairy type might be useful. That's a nice animation of the, um... The liquid popping up and back down. <laughs> oh! Here we go, Gossifleur is evolving. What was it called again? Eldegoss? Yeah. It's learning cotton spore. Eh. It's mostly a special attacker now, so Razor Leaf's not going to do a whole lot. Hmm. Harshly lowers speed. I I don't know. Nah. Between Cotton Down and Rapid Spin, I can get a sizable change in, uh... Wow, was that 0.7 pounds? Uh... What do we got? Mostly a special attacker, huh? Got a decent amount of HP. Sweet Veil. Eh. Not great. I think this evolves into Alchemy, though. Hi, Badoo. Hello! Don't make me worry like that, dude. Oh. I'm depressed. Ba ba da ba ba da ba. I wonder what the current recommendations thing is about, then. Like, what purpose does it serve other than to be updated? Run away! Tick. I'm just running into all the recommendations here. Not my precious speed stat. How could I lose? Not my precious speed stat.
Ah, I should probably go get some Pokeballs, though. And also, should probably heal my team. Hi, Hop. Don't talk to... Oh, okay. This is a quaint little village. Town. Hamlet. Give me some Pokeballs. Uh, ten's fine. Once I can buy Great Balls, that'll be uh, a bit more interesting. Uh, can I remember a different move? Leafage. Oh, no, that's physical still. Dang it. It's only got the four moves, you idiot. Uh, let me see here. Nope. 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 Uh, and nope. Okay. A geoglyph. I like that word. I guess if I had surf or the uh, equivalent of surf, I'd be able to get around that. This is a quaint little town, honestly. I like it. Brutal Swing. That's a dark move. Hey. Oh. More medicinal herbs. They're making those a little bit more plentiful, I'm noticing. Hi, Amper. Bow work. Gonna check out this shop first. And an item. What's with all the construction going on here? Unless it's trying to barricade the player from going anywhere. Hmm. Go this way. But I want to explore. So I'm gonna go this way. Three X attacks. That's a lot of X attacks. Leafstone. Yeah. Can I use that? Nope. Okay. Or actually, before I forget, let me equip Silver Powder to crawl. Tourist attraction! Man, someone cut the grass pretty well there.
Here's a trading card. Thanks for listening to me. I like that Yamper's just moving around during this. What's up, buddy? Bowark, indeed. There's a bottle of fresh water in this tin of fresh water. Weird, huh? Hello. I'm a squabbit. I can't quite reach this upside down, um, what's it called? Evolution of Bunnelby, Diggersby. Rock version of Diggersby. Uh, don't really need to worry about catching an Eevee right now. Not too hung up on it. How the heck? You are quick. I was just up there for like a couple of minutes and you just finished the gym fight? Well, this is a grass gym, so I should probably keep, uh, crawl out front and, uh, just in case. Let's have Flap up there. Combust could probably come in use with his fire moves, but, uh, fire move. We'll find out later. The ball guy! Have a friend ball! Wow, a friend ball? Isn't that a Gen 2 one? Yeah, that's a Gen 2 one. Sure. So this is your way of getting a regular Meowth, huh? But that's Xero. I can't do that. Wait. Cool! You can get new types of uniforms. That's awesome. Ooh. That's a cool uniform. Ooh, ooh, I like that. That that reminds me of Neon. Oh, I don't know, though. I might have to look into these a little bit later, but... Uh, that's cool. Like, that reminds me a little bit of tie-dye. It's uh, convenient that the uh, there's a shop in here. All right, let's do it. Got it. Yeah. Am ready. It's all a big spectacle, and I am really glad that it is, because that really... What's the word I'm looking for? It adds more personality to these gyms, rather than just go in there, and you fight some trainers, and go fight the gym leader. I kind of like that there's more spectacle now. So Dan is the, uh, is he the guy who goes champ in the making? Roll Wooloo. I feel like a dog, but, uh, I guess yampers are used to this. Come on, Wooloo. Look, there's a Yamper over there. <laughs> Get away from the Yamper. Go, go, go.
Samuel, of course. Well, that wasn't too difficult. I challenge you to battle, and you're dead. Well, at least he's a good sport about it. See, that's good conduct. That's good gen conduct right there. Uh, I will take them around the corner. Past this other gym trainer. I was very surprised he didn't see me up until that point. Mark my words. Valiant effort, however, um, no. Oddish. That's cute. Well, that's a problem. Thankfully, I picked up so many cherry berries off of those berry trees. Got him. Okay, before Yamper shows up again, I'm gonna cherry berry the heck out of a. What's his name? Okay, cherry berry out of crawl. There we go. Go, go, go. Speaking of go, 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 go isn't anywhere to be seen in this game, I don't think. I feel like that one would be a good fit, but uh, Go Goat and its pre evolution never showed up past this game, or past Gen 6. Uh, I will follow this Yamper over here. Go, go, go. Or I guess more accurately, it, Go Goat hasn't shown up in a Pokemon game past Gen 6. Because he's been in Smash. Why can't I remember Go-Goat's pre-evolution? It, it's those Gen 6 Pokemon. I don't really know the... Uh, um, I don't remember many of them because I'd only spent one playthrough going through them, uh, through the game. And um, a lot of them didn't show up again for Gen 7, so I'm still kind of not familiar with them, really. Still trying to remember it. Go Goat evolves from Nope, can't think of it. I guess that is one problem with Gen 6, is that a lot of them were just forgettable. He had some memorable final evolutions, but what a strong challenge is my other name. They had some memorable final evolutions, like, say, Aegislash or, uh, or Greninja, Barbarical, maybe. Well, speaking of Barbarical, I don't remember the... Oh, okay, no, I just remembered it, actually. It's Binacle. It's pre-evolution. In, uh, the Black and White Randomizer, I forgot about Tyrant and Tyrantrum being Rock and Dragon, because I just forgot that they were around. Uh, that one was my bad. Uh, they are fossils, so they should be a bit more memorable than that. 
Do I really not have many uh, poison healing things? Huh. Uh, well, I guess Peach Berry it is. Yeah, <laughs> had a feeling. Wait. Oh! That's cool! I appreciate that. A lot, actually. Alright, Milo. Isn't Milo the name of a, um... Of a powdered drink, like a chocolatey drink, in um, it's either European or Australia, I think, because I remember having something along those lines that was hot chocolate or some sort of chocolate drink when I was a kid. I don't remember from which travels that it uh, it showed up in though. Yeah, this is a spectacle, all right. Right into it. I like it. Let's go. Is Gossifleur an Eldegoss, right? Eldegoss. So I, got, I can Dynamax at any time. It's only for three turns, though. You know what? I'm digging this uh, this gym theme. It doesn't have Cotton Down. But I'm guessing Gossip Floor does. Oh, sorry. It, I'm guessing Eldegoss does. I should have probably put up Light Screen before this. Oh well. Taunt. Uh. I've got some speed to make use of it, but at the moment I don't think it's really useful. Weeds are pretty tough. You caught that one in an Ultra Ball, huh? Look at the Pokeball mascot in the back there. Alright. Oh, they're chanting. I hear them. Uh. Well, it's not going really to do much damage to my bug type, so... If I Dynamax... Alright, let's do it. Big boy. You're not the only one, though. Alright, but since he went first, I imagine uh, Eldegoss is going to be faster than, uh, than Crawl. This is going to put Grassy Terrain down, I think. Yeah, that leaves me in shock and awe, dude. That was a crit, too. <laughs> Alright, so Pokemon on the ground and Grass-type Pokemon will get uh, healed every turn. What's this one do again? Psychic Terrain. Prevents from priority moves, I think.
All right, he's probably going to heal it. He didn't heal it. That's impressive. All right. Not gonna lie, that was one of the better spectacles out there. Well, I just blew it the hell up. I like that. That's really cool. Aw, nice little personality quirk there. What an incredible gym challenger. That's my other name. His hand is huge. Oh, cool. So it makes up a, uh, a metal. 